I understand this isn't the best setup, but I wanted to get this filmed very quickly and we're going to just try to do a quick edit. I went to Goodwill. You'll see the footage either before or after this spiel. <laughs> These are just sitting right on top. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Is this another pair? Did I just find the Rothy's jackpot? Okay. This is crazy. Oh, sorry. Uh, I thought I hit the jackpot. I was so excited. Uh, they just rolled out a fresh bin of shoes. There was a couple of people who were looking through them first. I kind of just waited and I made my way in and I spotted this brand, this logo, red shoes. These right away are dead giveaway. I mean, I'm just, I'm going to bring them all, <laughs> all out. You would have been thinking this is a reseller's dream or a shooting reseller's dream anyway i mean here we go look at them i found i found a whole bunch of shoes so did i just find the rothy's jackpot or are these all fake i don't know gonna have to take a closer look okay so these are all uh, fake dupes knockoffs pretty good dupes though, but they're not actually Rothy's so I'm putting all of these back But I still got five pairs. So what turns out is Most of them were dupes obvious dupes. They didn't say Rothy anywhere on them They looked almost identical. The feel was pretty dang close. I was almost tempted I did check to see if any of the dupes were my size uh, to buy one for myself and see kind of how they wore how comfortable they were None of them were my size so I put them back. Um, I actually had to make an appointment. I literally had 30 to 45 minutes inside of this Goodwill. So it was a very rushing, kind of chaotic experience. Um, so I purchased all the ones that said Rothy on there because doing a really quick look, they all looked pretty dang good. I mean, like this one, you know, has this in here. So you can see my Goodwill price them at $7.49. You look at it, it does not look half bad at all. Look, there's a logo on the bottom. I mean, there is the flex, like the full flex. The material is amazing. But I just want to kind of share with you all quickly how to tell if they are fake. So one thing that I did is I took the insole out and I looked and I said, oh, it's got the size tag information. You know, great, perfect. I looked around like at the stitching the quality looks pretty dang good what I didn't do is I didn't look at the back <laughs> so this right here is definitely a very big red flag all of the fraying here in the thread sorry my nails aren't done or anything but this should not happen on authentic Rothy's right so that should be a number one flag the other flag is the sticker is very easily peel off it's a very shiny I'm gonna show you a side-by-side -side comparison but the actual label on a real authentic Rothy is more of a fabric textured like a cloth kind of material um, still I guess can technically kind of be peeled off but so I was going through all of these and I was disappointed disappointed um, another big dead giveaway is these say made in USA all Rothy's are made in China um, so I know that might change in the future, but they're not made in USA. So the label should say made in China. So here is another pair, right? So again, let's leave the sole in there. We're looking Rothy's looks good. Here's the back. There's the Rothy's logo. It's got the real nice flex. So very similar to these. Let me put the sole back. And I'm going to make the points very, very easy. Sum them up. But here are these two side by side. Here are the backs, side by side, there's the sides, we're doing, we'll do the flex test on both, they kind of both flex, <laughs> I know that's hard to tell, but 
They both have the same flex fabric material. Looking at them, the materials look and feel from my untrained eye, pretty identical. But going back to the blue pair, we take the sole out. Here's the sole and here's the back. Look at the back difference. I will throw them up again, a side by side comparison, but that back stitching is beautiful. Here is the inside stitching. Everything is still really nice, but look at the tag. Hopefully you can kind of see the difference already in the tag, but you also see it's made in China. So the tag is a material fabric style tag. Let me get that other one, the fake one out for you. Well, this is, there we go. So hopefully you can kind of see the difference in the texture. I know it's hard on camera, but you can definitely tell one is more shiny, kind of sticker-like, and the other one is more sticky fabric-like. And then one says made in USA, one says made in China. So going through these, I was already just like, man, okay, I found one one pair of authentic real Rothy's. I was very excited. Of course, it's the one that is in the most worn shape, but these you can definitely clean them up. So it's not a big deal. We had two pairs total in the reds that are fake, really, really good fakes, which is kind of a shame. Like one of them are actually my size, so I might keep one for myself. It depends too on if Goodwill will accept them or not. Now I'm going to go back same day. I'm making this video. Everything's happening same day to see if they will accept the return. If they accept it, great. I'll just return. If they don't, then I'll keep that pair. Maybe see if another pair fits my mom or something, if, if we like them. Um, but the next ones were these. So here we have these two. So the two red pairs are dead. The blue pair is a winner and so we have these two so I'm gonna throw one of these is real one of these is fake I'm going to give you all a chance I'm gonna show you both give you all a chance and see if you can pinpoint the real versus the fake before we go into any more depth here's the backs or the bottoms rather here's the bottoms there they are from a distance here they are from the side Nice little side view. We can do kind of a flex test. This is, we'll just call this one the gray pair and we'll call this one the black and white pair. <laughs> so pretty good, right? I mean, if you're just looking at them like this, I would say they both look real. Um, this one you can tell a lot better, so I'm, I saved this one. We'll do a close up now at the actual logo stitching. One clearly has the logo not touching the circle and the other one is the stitching is touching the circle so that is another giveaway but that one is a little bit harder to tell so this is the gray pair here is the back this is a lot easier way to tell you can see that that's very very messy in the gray pair here is the black and white pair and here's the back look at that nice clean beautiful stitching so and then we'll look at the insides and we see one of them is a fabric tag one of them is a shiny sticker tag and one says made in usa one says made in china so one of these is real it is the black and white pair this pair is an authentic rothy Thank goodness for me. Jumping in to mention one more difference is the fake pair. The sole is not does not show the size on it, whereas the authentic pair does. Even on the other more worn pair, there you see a seven and a half. Now let's take another sole out of one of the fakes, and there is no size. So and one more because it's super, super subtle, but the real pair Rothy's to the right you can see that it is the in, engraving is not as wide or deep, whereas this is the fake pair. It is definitely more noticeable. So I, I'm still very, very excited. This is still a win for me because I found two authentic Rothy's. I paid $7.50 a piece, so I paid $15 bucks for two of those. Uh, these, I haven't looked at the exact styles or anything, but at very, very minimum, I'm going to get no less than 70 but they can sell for anywhere from like 70 to 130 It just kind of depends. Uh, and then I got to make this video. I got to really learn and educate because I knew Rothy's were faked, but I didn't realize that they were faked this well. So I think that this is a very good 
learning video for me and for anybody else who might come across a deal like this. There are very, very easy ways to tell the difference. So I just wanted to share all those ways with you. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope uh, it helps you to not make a bad buy out in the wild or to get very, very lucky and feel free to get super excited the instance you come across some actual authentic Rothy's. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. Y'all have a great day. I'm going to go try to return these other three pairs and I'll catch y'all next time. Bye!